Hi, I'm Brad from Wet the Tech. Let's talk about the differences between screen size and screen resolution. A question we are often asked at Wet the Tech is what matters more, screen size or screen resolution? Well, the answer is relatively simple once you understand the differences between these two terms. Screen size is just what it sounds like, the actual physical size of the screen. However, unlike most things, screen size is measured diagonally, as opposed to vertically or horizontally. As you may imagine, depending on their aspect ratio, which is the ratio of a screen's width to its height, two screens that have the same diagonal measurement could have very different overall surface areas. Take this example. Here we have two 10-inch screens. However, one is a square and one is a rectangle. Calculating their individual areas shows us that the square screen is actually 15% larger overall than the rectangle screen. If these were real products, they would both be advertised as having a 10-inch screen, despite the significantly larger surface area of the square screen. Each of these screen types would have different advantages depending on what type of content you are viewing. The square screen would be better for text documents because there would be less wasted space on either side of the text you were working on. However, the rectangular screen would be much more ideal for watching movies and TV shows where you would have less wasted space above and below the content you're viewing. For a real world example, let's compare these two LG monitors. One is a 27 inch monitor and one is a 29 inch ultra wide monitor. Well, at a glance, the 29-inch monitor looks bigger. The 27-inch monitor actually has 2.3% more surface area. By being an informed consumer, you can choose a screen that is right for your needs instead of falling prey to marketing tricks. Screen resolution refers to how many pixels make up a screen. Pixels are those tiny little squares you see if you look really close to a TV or a computer monitor. A common screen resolution most people are familiar with is 1080p, also referred to as Full HD. 1080p is shorthand for 1920 pixels by 1080 pixels. That means that a screen has 1920 horizontal pixels multiplied by 1080 vertical pixels which comes out to over 2 million pixels. While that may seem like a lot of pixels, it really depends on what size screen you're viewing them on. If you pack 2 million pixels into a 10-inch tablet, you're going to get a very crisp image. However, if you expand those pixels to fill a 100-inch TV, all of a sudden the image you're looking at loses a lot of its clarity. Two reasons people may be interested in a higher resolution screen is either to, one, view more content on the same size screen, or two, view the same content just in a much clearer picture. Let me show you some visuals to explain those two hypotheticals. For simplicity's sake, let's imagine that you have a screen that's two pixels by two pixels, and a web browser that has a minimum size of two pixels by two pixels. On this screen, you could fit one web browser. Pretend you are viewing this web browser on a 50-inch TV. That would be a lot of space for just one web browser. Now imagine you have a 50-inch TV that's four pixels by four pixels. On this second screen, you would have more options. You could view four browsers at once, each taking up the two pixels by two pixels that the original browser used, or view one web browser on the screen, just like in the first example, but at a four times greater resolution, or four times clearer, than the browser in the first example. As you may imagine, the bigger the screen you're working on, the more benefit there is to having a higher resolution. If you had run this same thought experiment with a 10-inch tablet, you could clearly see that four web browsers packed into a 10-inch screen would be way too cramped to get any use out of. One final thing to keep in mind is the distance that you're sitting away from whatever screen you're using. A 50-inch TV at 1080p looks great from eight feet away. However, the image gets a lot less clear if you were sitting two feet in front of the TV. 
In this situation, you would be better off with a higher resolution TV. These general rules apply to any screen you could use, phones, tablets, laptops, you name it. The reason a 10 inch 1080p tablet looks so crisp in contrast to maybe a 50 inch 1080p TV is that they each have the same exact amount of pixels. However, the smaller the screen, the less space there is in between each of those pixels, resulting in a much clearer image. Thanks for watching the video. If you liked it, consider subscribing to our YouTube channel and be sure to check out whatthetech.io.